the seal is broken. Let's put on the hand cam real quick. He's like Tasty Steve when he takes off the arm beads. All right, I guess they're going. No boys. The Romuk, by the way, guys, took off his socks, too. He's bare feet on the front stage right now he, in front of the crowd. Out. He's actually barefoot. Yeah, he's barefoot he's out here. Barefoot. <laughs> Are we ready to go? Rock Zero 2019, first match of the day. Mr. Pekka's versus Naroma. First to two. I can't believe he took off his socks. Full power, man. My yeah, man you you want to save that for grand finals, but he knows Pekka's is a threat. He's trying to replicate optimal yep. net play settings. Yeah, 4-2. We're going to break it right yet. off the bat. Yeah. Hey, hey. Just wants to keep him here, sacrificing the damage for the position. The uh, the names are switched, guys. Don't worry about it, right? Petko's running geese, Naroma running. Wait a second, the seal? What happened to the seal, the Obama? Ceiling? He took off the socks and he brought out Jack. He's going full power from the start. Well, the thing is here, you, you got to race it too, right? This is the winner semis. Yep. Not yet guaranteed a top three spot. But after this, from here on out, if anyone's able to get in there, they're going to have to play longer sets. Yeah. They're going to have to be careful. It's going to be a rough road. Trade. You gotta watch out. That down 4-2 was kind of what sealed the first round as well. Unsafe, but Naroma just used it so well. Up there, so you get a little punish. 1-1-2. Well, one, but backing away this time. Nice. Hey. He gets a big counter hit. Try going for the running too, but he's up back three instead. Then knee. Oh, he's dead. He is definitely dead. Hey. Gets to save the floor break as well. He's about to build another bar as well. So that first round, you know, Naroma took that. We talked about it yesterday, how important the, the meter is for Geese. Right, whenever you can win a round without spending a bar, if he only spends one, that's good for him. If he spends a bar and loses the round, that's good, really, really big for And that opponent. says a lot about how Pekos feels yep. against Naroma, too. Most pieces, you see them trying to save the bar, trying to save up for two or three for later rounds. He's spending right away. He's like, no, I got a round. I got to be able to take it against Naroma, especially if he's running Jack. Yeah, and that's just the kind of respect that he's putting on nice him right stuff. now. Oh, the Touch big the sky. And that's the thing, too. You know, once he does have meter, that kind of changes the matchup against Jack. Jack can't go willy-nilly just throwing out certain things because he's going to get that knee into the max mode cancel into whatever he wants. He could go downstairs. Hey. And he won that round. But anyway, he's got two bars now. He's got the reset at the wall for a ton of damage. He's got two hits to kill right now. If he touches him, he's yeah. going to use it. He's definitely going to use it. This is not what we expected. It's not what we Snipes expected. This is start, right? This is big. Yep. Max oh. jab carry all the way to the wall. Stomp Two bars. Jordan, I'll break that floor. Does he want a Red Dick Storm here? No, he wants to save it. All right, one more hit. It could be it. Yeah, one more hit could definitely be the round here. Got it. Max cancel. That's is up the combo, though. Give me the a second chance to get the reset. Crash jab cancel. Off the wall bounce. Go downstairs one more time. Save it. Up. Double rep ender. Still saving that last bar. Gets it. Pack goes. 1-0 over Naroma. Look at he, he's, he's smiling. He messed up. He definitely didn't want that low. He wanted to go up, plant the plant the seeds on his feet right there. Couldn't do it. Three rounds straight though. What's up? Put your socks back on. What is Damn. up? And that was not just a 3-0. That, no. that was a fast 3-0. That was a fast 3 Fart, change the game. Turn it off Tekken 7. Put it on Twitch IRL. We got the <laughs> shoes off. I need y'all dropping bits, donations, everything in the chat right now. Naroma got his, his, his raw feet on the stage. So the Jack pick, we've talked about how you, he's been saving Jack. You usually got to pay for that kind yeah, of stuff. Yeah. <laughs> That's why we're not showing it. We haven't shown it yet. Yeah, so we talked about Jack been sealed, 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 but he brings him out after, feels like months, and just gets walked. That's what happens. Maybe he hasn't been practicing the character. Maybe, I don't know. So he's going back to drag. This is a character we've been seeing him play more often recently. Heck, so is playing for dear life. He's stuck with drag, though. Yeah, he, he locked set. in. He locked in. He is stuck. So this could be good, it could be bad, but it gives Pekos a chance to kind of think things through. That was a wash. What the hell? Jack was whack, man. Yeah, look, Pekos got, got confident. He got Birdman hands going on right now. He's feeling it. He knows just one more game, three more rounds, and he's out there and wins his final. And this is, I don't think anybody yeah. really expected this either, dude. Typically, when they play this matchup, Naroma has heavy advantage. Right? Both of these guys are pro license holders in yeah. Japan. They played numerous times in tournament settings. Naroma is usually the clear winner of this set. Well, we got we got the Naroma dragon off now, right? So let's see the drag. He's locked in, like you, you said, is right. But again, this is the character to do the most work for him recently. Yeah, and I think you know maybe this is another telling of what the Japanese community, what's happening in the Japanese community. I think it's it's safe to say that Geese is taking over, man. Yeah, man, he's the future. Geese is taking over. He's been here. This is my game now. He's a down, <laughs> baby. King of Tekken Seven. Side set. Gets a knockdown here. Peck is a lifely back and away, throwing out the Rapukins, trying to keep Naroma out, and he ate two of them right there. Throw him off the building. Oh, here we go. Got the float. Double Rapukin, that damage, and again, Peck was continuing his domination. Trades, that's it, four rounds straight. He's looking too strong right now. I feel like I, we I, haven't I, even been seeing, like, Geese. We haven't even seen any of the crazy Geese stuff yet. He's just outplaying Naroma every time. Nice, duck and yep. launch a return. 
usage is big. And look at Noroma. Noroma is going in. He's playing aggressively movement-wise, but he's not yeah, hitting yeah, a commitment offensively. Button. He's not doing anything, but a big counter hit there. Yeah, gets a full string. Good damage here. Noroma with a life lead for the first time in this set, I'm going to say. Hey, confirms. And that's probably what he's scared of. I mean, that's exactly, I think, what he's afraid of. But now, most another meter as well. Second hit did not connect. They're very fortunate. Norm able to roll out. Pekko's own. That one touch takes the life lead. Get off. He got that bar. He got the bar. Weak condition now if he wants it. Yeah, side step here. He's trying to fish in. Off the plus frames, taking some mids. Pekko's with big positional advantage here, too. A lot of just jab checks and down for one check. Gamma trying to seal the Roma's. Ah! Got him! Look at the time! Oh, he messed up! What a oh. off! What's going on? What happened here? That is probably the Holy choke of and the just set. Like, bro, off that one drop, Pekos is on set point. Dude. Pekos is about to... Holy shit. Look yeah. at your punches ticket. The winner's finals here against yeah. Naroma? Oh, and the duck. Yep, the, punish. the punish. Let's go. He has two he got meters. got two bars, too. He got two bars, man. This is scary. You get a wall combo, reset the Raging Storm, any hit and confirm. Yes, I feel like Naroma's afraid to attack here. Yeah, it's like a loaded gun. You get near Geese, knife comes out, still the, the life difference is, is inconsequential. Fishing with Ian. Pekos now willing to, willing to just chill, let him come to me. Uh-oh, punish. Jab check. 1-1-2, one, one, I'll take my damage. Here's Burn the, the meter, yep. Chase him down. Off the pressure, this yep. is what top players do. He's got another bar, it doesn't matter. He can afford to spend that meter to keep the pressure going. 10 seconds left. No. Okay, he gets a punish. He gets some hits in. Naroma needs this. Still There's wide it. open. No, Still he wide doesn't open. spend it. There's no time left. Side step, low check. All right, yeah, all right. This round, a good block. Nice. Yeah. Just lame him out. Good play from Naroma, but still, two bars on for Pekos. And he still has match point right now. Oh, he, and he finally he gets the big crush. Not only that, he's going to get the wall here. Break. Oh, he uh, missed the follow-up. Still got a lot of damage here and keeps the pressure going. So oh, he still gets, not comes out. He though. went for the pickup there. He thought he was close enough. But this is the thing here. Pekos gets one hit, and it could be game over. He's on three. Yeah. Now if Pekos he gets the one back. In if way. he gets the knee cancel into the radio store, it's over. Yeah. So by block. The thing is, the way the stage is built. Ooh, oh, my God. Ready. Oh, my God. That was gangster. We saw him go for that in the last time, right? Pekos held off. This time he went for the follow-up there, and the Roman's ready. He remembered. And now after that crazy domination from, from Pekos, all that momentum is now on the Roma side. One round away from tying it up with that three bars. God damn. Hey. Oh, he gets the grab and that's big. I think the stream monster is going to see something. I think the stream monster is going to see something. They're going to learn. No, he didn't get the wall. He was so close. Yeah, that would have been the round, maybe. No, it would have definitely done a lot of damage there. But still sitting on two meters here. Oh my gosh, he gets it. Yeah, that's it. Running that's one. It. No, he didn't get the ender. Hey, runs up and plants the rice seeds all over his feet to put your damn shoes back on. <laughs> he, he did it for a statement. Yep. He was he tapped his toes. He said, Bare "Not feet. on my stage." <laughs> he got yeah. That's embarrassing. Got to put the socks on first before you put the shoes yeah, back he's on. He's waiting you know? for him. Oh, he just touches dirty feet. Now get a handshake. Wash your hands. <laughs> Pecos, watch your hands. Okay. So that, oh, that changes our fantasy. Yeah, that's brackets. crazy. That's. We were talking about this before we went live. We're like, man, if you had to pick maybe the, the players with maybe the lowest odds to be able to take this win. I don't think anybody saw Pekos going over to Roma to beat Punches Ticket for winners finals, like, especially not 2-0 like that. No. I, yeah, Naroma showed is, like none of us, yeah. None of us picked them. Yep. None of us picked them to take that match, but a different Pekos showed up today. And you look okay, at some I of the action that we just missed here. That first game. Oh, man. I can't even really have time to clip that first he game. He reminded him why he five. dropped Jack. Yep. He reminded him. And all of a sudden, this loser's bracket, too. Oh, man. You got the winner of Kelthu in low high going up against Naroma next. Yeah, and this was huge right here, yeah. right? If he had won that round, that would have been that round he needed to reset it. The raise drive, that, that was over. But good awareness, actually, from Pekos there. You know, he didn't give up. He didn't take his hands off the control. He was ready to punish after the drop there, staying alive. Oh, man, great stuff. And, you know, he obviously securing himself a top three yep. placing now. In our winner's final, he's going to be waiting, and he's going to be facing the winner of the next yeah, match that we're yeah. going to be seeing. And this one's going to be big because, I mean, unexpectedly, we have Peru, a yeah. representative Abel de Maestro. And, I mean, we I picked Chikorin. I, for, even uh, yesterday, today, I'm like, Chikorin's yeah. going to win, he's going to win, he's going to win. Same way I thought Naroma's going to win, but today, I guess anything could happen, right? On this stage, Abel man, win, out man. here, dude, like this. This, dude, this weekend in 2019, yeah. dude, anything, anything's possible. Like we were talking about it, this stage, you know, anything goes now. 
First thing that happened on this stage, Homeboy takes off his shoes. He takes off his socks. <laughs> I don't know what else is going to be happening. But Here we go. We got, got Abel the, the Maestro from Peru. 